This video is not specifically dedicated to getting the harmonic balancer off of Ford Small Block. There are plenty of videos out there that do that. What this video is designed for and what I couldn't find on the internet is how to stop the harmonic balancer from spinning in reverse. How did I do that? You, you can see my first attempt, I tried to take off that center bolt with the impact gun. Hey, follow along and we'll, we'll get through this together. Harmonic balancer removal with that center bolt. Trying to remove that is a nightmare. So I've devised this concoction in this video to help everybody out here on my 289. This should work on your Ford small block, whether it be a 302 or a 351. Lefty Lucy applies reverse rotation pressure on that harmonic balancer, counterclockwise, spinning the engine in the opposite direction. It should spin. Most people would say, why don't you just clamp down the flywheel at the rear of the engine? That would be nice if I had access to that flywheel. In order to gain access, you could remove the starter, but that would be a pain in the rear end. I did attempt to take a crowbar and wedge it in the drive shaft, but that was unsuccessful as there was still play in the engine. Anyways, you can see what I did. I decided to take the bolts of the belt pulley and these wrenches. Everybody should have wrenches. Everybody should have cargo straps. So I cinched these down tight. I put this around the, the bulkhead and then I took my 15 16 socket and you must use a breaker bar. If you're using anything else, you're just gonna, um, you're gonna be here all day. And then, and then, and granted I've already loosened this up, so. Loosen that up. And now you got the bolt out. Now take everything off. Come over here. And now you can gain access to use your harmonic balancer puller. But that is how you stop the engine from rotating in reverse. So I'm gonna go ahead and take all this stuff off. Take the harmonic balancer off, take the chiming chain cover off, reseal everything back up with with all my new components. So be sure to subscribe and like, and just enjoy this video. The next portion of this video, I had an opportunity to showcase me removing the harmonic balancer on my 289. Unfortunately, the footage and documentation turned into a fiasco mess that I don't wanna post on the internet. I did in the end get the job done, but I've condensed it to about a minute long video to spare me from ridicule from the internet because my skin is thin and I'm too sensitive to handle getting abuse from the internet. But be sure to subscribe because I pulled this sample video out of a larger portion that I'm making, removing the harmonic balancer, timing chain cover, and water pump just because the whole front end of that engine is leaking. So gotta fix it somehow. But for the sake of visual education purposes, I'll just finish off this video showing me removing the harmonic balancer. So if you guys want to see how I did it, just watch the rest of the video.